Right. First attempt to video blogging. Don't know what the mic's like, don't know what the camera's like. I know what the road surface is like. It's a bit damp. It's uh, just peed hard for about uh, 30 minutes, just as I was looking forward to a nice ride out. Fit the new uh, Drift Ghost S with the plug-in mic somewhere in my crash helmet that keeps falling off. But we'll see how we go. Him. No, it's not. Fuck. Fucking car drivers. Yeah. <laughs> Left at the lights. Through Sunny Lewis. Yeah, as I say, I've not been. Uh, I've only just set it all up. I only just bought it the other day and haven't really had time to mess about with it. So, thought I'd give it a go. Watching a few video logs on uh, YouTube and that, and uh, they're right. It is weird travelling along, talking to yourself, and there'll be a lot of pregnant pauses while I try and concentrate on what's happening. Perhaps we should go through the puddle. No, perhaps we shouldn't. Also got a camera fitted down by the back wheel, which is probably now got a soaked through lens, so we won't be able to see much on that. I don't think I did a brilliant job of cleaning off the front screen when I put the ghost on there. So uh, but th these things are sent to test us, so we'll see how it goes later on uplink it to the computer and uh, see what a complete hash I've made of it. Yeah, as I say, it was uh, quite a nice sunny day up until, well, about half four I suppose. And then decided to pee hard just to make everything all slippery and wet. And, uh, I would say ruined my first transmission, but uh, I'm probably doing a very good job of that myself. Not really uh, one to talk and ride. A bit different when the miss is on the back. I've got the intercom system, so she's busy telling me where to go and how to get there and at what speed to do it at and to behave myself on the bench but you will probably live that dream as well. Right, so, uh, right along long as a um, Suzuki GSX 1250 that I'm riding on. Bought it uh, mid-October last year after just passing my test. Something I'd wanted to do for years and years and years, but had a family and obviously a practical vehicle came first but uh, the missus gave us the go ahead to do my licence just saying something stupid like I think you're sensible enough to ride a bike now um, and that was it sold my BMW to finance the test and oh well a deposit on the bike, I don't know about uh, paying for the bike, that's on the strap at the moment, but um, no I haven't looked back, had it, as I say since mid-October and uh, so far I've done just over 13,000 miles, can't complain about the recent weather and uh, even over the winter months it wasn't too bad, you had a few completely rained off day but uh, no worries with the uh, ice and snow and everything. So uh, yeah, I've had a good run for my money. 
well I say I've had a good run, I'm on the third rear tyre, second front tyre, and we've got the big big service coming up soon with the valve clearances being checked. That's about 500 quid service, so in less than a year I've done a few quid on it. But uh, as I say, also done the miles. I only commute about um, 25 miles a day. So the rest of it has been pleasure riding. Yeah, I don't know what you people uh, have to talk about. To be honest, I mean the, uh, the roads aren't really good enough to have a lot of fun. They're probably all gravelly and shitty up here. Would have been about an hour ago. Well, a couple of hours ago now. I mean, it's eased off, but. It'll threaten again. But as I say, yeah, we've had a good summer. Been a few shows, which has been nice. Bought myself a little 250 as well. Probably have some footage of that up one day. Um, little KLR 250, just to do a bit of byways. A bit of off-roading. I'm crap at that as well. I can only improve. Possibly. Yeah, I don't know, but what everyone else has got for a crash here. I mean, I've got an AGV Horizon, so is the wife. Um, and I do find it rather noisy inside. I've uh, adjusted the visor as much as I could to counteract it but I'd sort of grip it with two hands and really force it shut. Um, I don't know whether the mic's picking up a lot of wind noise now or not. Or whether the mic's picking up anything really. I don't know what sensitivity I've set it to. But uh, yeah as I say it's a test process so we'll see. down underneath the swing arm. I was hoping to catch you some nice bits of cornering. Well, as good as I can get anyway. Um, obviously the wet weather's probably put a bit of to that. Although it does seem quite dry up here, so... Road, but flat and black, it's just not interesting. Oh, yes, oh, yes, get your trailer out. That's it. Which way, which way, which way, which way, which way? I think this way. Rear tyres. I think the first one did about 5,000 miles, the second one did about 6,000 miles, which by all accounts isn't too bad. Um, 
the first one I got a puncher in within the first thousand miles and had it plugged, proper patch plug, which lasted its life. Second one I had no hassle with. Um, third one, again after about a thousand miles, got a puncher in it. The AA's plugged it, just an ordinary plug, not a patch plug. Um, so I'm sort of chancing it at the moment after paying out sort of 130 quid on a tyre I didn't want to go immediately and have to buy another one so uh, as the AA man said at your own risk sort of thing so sort of warranted it for 65 mile an hour and 500 miles well I've done twice that in both respects so A lot of people have said the, the ones the AA put in are a bit uh, a bit more specialist than the, the ones that you just buy off of eBay and do yourself. So whether I'm a fool for believing that, I don't know. I'll find out on a corner when it bursts, I suppose. And I go spinning into a bush somewhere. This is Sunny Ditchlin, or not so Sunny Ditchlin. Yeah, if, if anyone does actually uh, ever view this, definitely leave some comments. Funny, serious, helpful, hindrance, not bothered with. I'll take it all, I'll take it all with a pinch of salt, apart from the stuff that I take serious, which I'll cry myself to sleep, worrying that everybody hates me. No, I fucking won't. <laughs> got the, uh, I've got the wife at home, that's all the support I need. I mean obviously it'd be nice to get support from other motorcyclists doing the similar thing or considering doing a similar thing. But uh, yeah, I just don't mine's a blank, you know, I've never I've never been a public speaker. I've been a gobshite and a piss taker, but not a public speaker. So it's it's all new to me. I don't really like announcing my private life to the world but then again if I don't announce who I am I suppose it's it's not my private life that's getting announced looks like he's going exactly the way that I'm going which really will top the day off this is going to the service for donuts no going up the A23 leave me to have a bit of fun before I don't know whether you can see it that big black cloud unleashes its moisture on me oh moisture mm. there are certain words aren't there a bit of moisture Where's he gone? There you are, you sneaky little fucker. That was good. Pulled up and still in reverse. Can we go round? Let's go round. Yeah, so what I don't use video wise with me doing <laughs> a proper shit job of talking to anybody out there, hello, 
Is there anybody out there? If I hadn't talked to anyone. And um, yeah, as I say, the, the rest of the footage I'll just put on for the sheer hell of it. Put the actual bee gobbing off, I think that would be <laughs> cut down quite considerably. I'll just go around here. As I say, I've got the camera on the back. I just want to see if I can get some. I don't know if I'm brave enough with it, having been wet. See where it turns out. 